heartbreaking scream could be heard from nearby houses. One of the mags who lived nearby approached Aura's hut and started knocking on the windows. Unfortunately, apart from an agonizing scream, he heard no response. The only solution was to force the door open to find the source of the scream. A few blows from the shoulder were no obstacle to the old wooden door. When the glow of the torch broke through the darkness, the man's eyes revealed the figure of Aura lying on the floor, but there was someone else there. A frightened girl with purple hair, sitting in the corner, crying loudly. Aura, I can't believe you did it. We advised you against it. However, Aura was still alive. She was exhausted, but alive. Without thinking too long, he ran for help to save the witch and the child.